Hi everyone, so here are the big news for today. First of all, in terms of privacy, you probably wouldn't believe it, but a lot of companies are still scanning all of your emails to find out personal information so they can better sell your stuff. This article was just published today in the Wall Street Journal uh, saying that many developers uh, take advantage of, uh, you know, when you sign up using uh, your email account, for example, and then if you don't read the little fine prints, well, they can actually read your emails. Actually, technically, most of the time, it's machine reading your email, but in some cases, it's even humans who read your email. So that's crazy. So that just goes to show there is still a long way to go in terms of uh, privacy in our world. And I tweeted about this article. You can find it. I tweeted this afternoon. Um, another thing I want to talk about is that Cisco acquired yet another uh, cybersecurity company. This one focused on authentication on the cloud. And this also goes to show that more and more companies are moving to the cloud. It's kind of inevitable to work on the cloud nowadays. Uh, this is actually one of my beliefs also. And uh, we just need some better ways to protect ourselves. So, um, you know, I think it's anything that goes in that direction of better protecting the companies and uh, people's information that are on the cloud, it's, it's good news. Um, now we go to Chile, so to South America. And we have two news from there, actually. There was a big... Uh, stealing of uh, banking information of people, so you know, this tends to happen quite often. But the more positive news is that there was an effort from Telefonica and local partners to make sure that women would be more involved in cybersecurity. And I think that's really important uh, that women get more involved, actually, in business in general, in technology in particular, and in cybersecurity even more. You know, it's a field where they're not very present. Uh, actually, at Cinedis, uh, we're very lucky that we have a very balanced team. We're about 50-50% of men and women, so I'm very proud of that and very happy about that. Um, the, actually, the news about, uh, there is, the last news about Chile actually is uh, there is a, an agreement between Spain, where we're based, and Chile to work on cybersecurity things. I'll, uh, I'll tweet you guys this thing later on this evening. Anyway, this is it for today. As you know, there is always a lot happening in cybersecurity and privacy. So be safe online and offline. Cheers.